Are you happy this morning? Yes. Thank you. And then to our young Rasul Tuano, who lives on a more passport, I give my great one on a more of the game. And today I'm going to talk to you about changing your thinking. Changing your thinking. You need to change your thinking. But before I can talk to you about changing your thinking, I'm going to tell you about my life story growing up as a teenager. Your age. Growing up, I was a very popular boy. I started dancing when I was like five years. I started rapping, doing hip hop that you love today. I started doing that when I was 12. I started DJing when I was 13. I bought my first set table when I was 13. I was DJing, getting gigs, Kidalamanyalo, the party, birthday party. I was playing there, getting money. But I surrounded myself with wrong people. People are called friends. I surrounded myself with those people. Then they introduced me to things like Matekwani, marijuana, you know that was. Matekwani, we started smoking Matekwani at a very young age. At a very young age. Bear in mind, I was an A student. I never got anything below 80%. But the moment I started touching them, my grades started dropping. They started dropping. We got to high school, things got worse. We are not focusing on school, we are not studying anymore. We are just doing it just to get by. Went to home with life, went to home with life, was just doing it just to get by. After grade 12, I studied digital music composition. I did music as a profession. <laughs> studied music at Boston City Campus. I graduated. I did radio production after that. I graduated. I thought everything was going to be smooth. Because I knew growing up, I didn't think they did. I thought everything was going to be smooth. If you are not humble, God will humble you. God will humble you if you are not humble. God will humble you. God humbled me. I had a very, very, very serious humbling experience. I got into depression. I was depressed. Got a guitar to my tech one, yeah. Smoked that way too much. Then it triggered what is called bipolar to me. For you who don't know bipolar, bipolar is a mental illness whereby you are sometimes happy, you are sometimes sad. So you need medication to stabilize you. Medication stabilizes you. That's what I'm living with today. I'm living with bipolar today because of the decisions that I made growing up. Stupid decisions that I made. Today, I have to take medication for the rest of my life. So you see how, how we decide when we grow up. The importance of taking good care of your life is very crucial. So today I'm living with bipolar, but to me this car, it was not to help me. It was for me to motivate others that are going through the same thing and to talk to people who might go into some things like this. So now today, as I'm going to talk to you about changing your thinking, it's time to change your thinking. Most of you here, you come from families where you're disadvantaged. They can't buy you school shoes. You don't have proper uniform. But you are here playing. You are here playing. What's happening? You're the child, not the class. 
You are here playing. It's time to change your thinking. Change your mind to see positivity in every situation. It's time to change your thinking. Once you can have control over your mind, everything you want is possible. Everything you want is possible. If you can have control over your mind, everything you want is possible. But you need to transform your thinking. Would you think you this follow? Or you want to create a better future? You need to be the generation that breaks curses in your family. You need to be the first billionaires in your country, in your family. You need to create your own BMWs. You need to come up with your own Mercedes Benzes. You need to be the, 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 the first child that invents something that will take South Africa to the world. Instead of just being consumers of everything. It's how we produce as a nation. But we depend on you. The children are the future of this world. The children are the future of this world. So it's time to change your thinking. Stop focusing on trying to be a cool ch child in class. That's not what you are here for. You are here to create a better future for your life. You are here to change the lives of your families. So, Lunaka Kassi, Matishaya, Muka Lunaka, and Muka Lunaka. The school did not pay me to come here and talk to you guys. I came here for free because I love you. Same as your teachers, they love you when they are here. They love you. They are not your friends. They love you. So it's time you take a stand and say, I'm going to be the better child. I'm going to create a better future for my life. Focus on your boots. Some of you, you are getting low marks. And it's not because you are not trying. It's because you are not trying hard enough. You're not studying. So now, I'm going to give you an opportunity to change your life. Please say this prayer after me. Ne? Say, Dear Lord Jesus, I repent of my sins. Come into my heart. I make you my Lord and Savior. Amen. If you just pray that prayer, you are a new person now. You are born again now. You are born again now. You are born again now. You are born You are to take South Africa to the world. Chapel and Thank you.